Hello. Hi, everybody. Do we have to have parts to request to build or is it even possible for you to build some random keyboards? It really depends, dude. Um, I'm gonna be honest. It really depends. Uh, the only reason I ask people to like provide their own parts, dude, my hair, I had a shower before and I didn't do my hair. So this is like, no, anyways, it doesn't matter. I only ask people to provide their own parts because it gets kind of dicey when I order things. Um, I've done it a few times for, for people and I've like let them know ahead of time, like this is gonna cost you extra money because importing it into Canada rather than just like importing it yourself and then shipping to me is actually the cheaper way. It's actually just easier for you to ship it to yourself than ship it to me. It's just cheaper. Like it just, it's actually even better for you. That way there you can verify everything too. I, I'm gonna be a hundred with you guys. I still think the best value you can get for switches, like the most smooth, best value switches are gonna be KTT roses. And if you don't wanna lube switches, literally the stuff I'm gonna show you guys today and do the stuff I'm doing today, these are the second best value switch IMO. These are from Wuche Studios. These are pre-lubed. These are amazing. Any good RC boards in stock? Someone told me there's one from, chat, what's that one brand you guys told me? Akko? Akko has one maybe? OGR raffle? Dude, I don't win any raffles. I'm actually having like, I'm not gonna say what, but something I paid for <laughs> a little while ago got lost in the mail. Like it was supposed to deliver here in Ontario and somehow it ended up in New Brunswick. Sneakbox Ava? Oh really, that's in stock. Hey, I heard Alex is doing keyboards. Can you confirm that Alex is doing keyboards? Mm, I might be, dude. Maybe. Akko or, uh, Akko or ACR Alice. Akko is out of stock? Oh. I love the 700E, but it's, a, uh, it's double my budget. Chat, dude, I can't stress enough how important it is. Dude, like, I saw a bunch of people on, on my, my comment section on, I think it was Instagram, argue about this. Uh, but just about like prices of stuff, regardless of any price of any hobby of anything that you're ever in, dude, you should like, if your immediate reaction is to like, be unsure about your budget, like that's why I love that you have your budget. You, you have to, dude, you have to like take care of your finances. I saw someone talking about how like they were gonna like go broke for a month to buy something. And then someone else like, you know, trying to give that person good financial advice. And them just being like, no, dude, it's worth the hype. It's never worth the hype, chat. All right? You not being able to pay rent and eat food for the month is not worth the hype. I can't stress that enough, dude. It is 1,000% not worth the hype, dude. It's worth the hype. Oh, my God. Food is temporary. Keyboards are forever. Actually, not really. Would a keyboard technically be forever? I'm hoping this build turns out picture perfect for this client. Well, it is a friend, so I hope they like it anyways. Let's be real here, chat. With all the new PBT sets coming out, do you guys feel less inclined to buy GMK sets? Honest truth, I know this might not be, might not, uh, might not be a question for everyone, but like, it, there's less of like a reason to buy GMK with all the, right? I still love GMK and I prefer much my GMK sets. It's really tough to like make that decision. I understand that from a consumer side of things. Like even me, it's tough to buy a GMK set when I know I can just buy something that looks just as good in PBT. I still prefer ABS plastic for keycaps, personally. Look how cute these. These are such a pretty pink. Such a pretty pink. Oh chat, I think after this I might watch Morbius. I heard it's a really good movie, by the way. I heard Morbius is fan-fucking-tastic. You guys all recommend Morbius, right? Everyone here recommends Morbius? Very sa salmon-y. Do you guys say salmon or salmon? Get your morb- I'm thinking about just morbin' out tonight, dude. I really want a morb. I really just want a morb tonight, dude. <laughs> GMK Morbin? Bro, who's making that? Someone get on that right now, dude. Thank you guys so much for being here tonight. Love you guys. You guys are freaking awesome. Can you give us a good huh? Huh? Ooh, this set's super cute. 
This is a very cute set. I really like this set. Super cute. Is it play FR4 it is? It is indeed. Uh, how do you fix the space bar? Um, so, it, I don't know if you can tell, but there's like, this kind of bends up in the middle ever so slightly. My way of fixing PBT, you can, I mean, you can warm the plastic, you can use some hot water, some boiling water. I tend to just get a, a hair dryer and I'll put something very heavy on top of it and just dr hair dry it. And then that has worked for me pretty much every single time. Please do it with caution. That's just how I fix PBT. How are you guys doing today? Appa, can I interest you in um, this really cool thing here? I forget what this is called, the play tray. It's so much fun to watch this thing spin around in circles. Oh, this is cute. These are cute, these are cute color switches. The keyboard hobby is like a girlfriend. They're both pretty and take your money. I mean, not all girls take your money, dude. I think, I think, I think that's a bad stigma. Any, any toxic person can take your money. Any scam artist can take your money. Boomer humor? A little bit. This is some awesome switch packaging. Yeah, I like this switch packaging a lot. I think I'm gonna pre-put some polyfill in here just cause I know it needs it. Dude, I bought this bag of polyfill like a year and a half ago and I haven't even like used all that much and I swear I put it in like 20 different keywords. Yeah, I'm a big muffin fan. I like muffins too. The only dessert thing that I really don't like is cupcakes. I think cupcakes are an actual scam. Let me explain to you guys why I think cupcakes are a scam. Because they're so freaking expensive. And I swear to God, they're just like, a, they're less than a slice of cake. Dude, cupcakes are actual scam. Lemon loaves are good too. Ooh, dude, you know what's really good? Scones. A good scone is actually top tier too. Maple scones. Oh, those are actually top tier. Of course, man, love your content. Been waiting, uh, wanting to build for a couple of years and finally pulled the trigger. What'd you pick up? I feel like now is a real, like, I keep saying it. I think I've been saying it for like a month and a half now, but now is like a really good time to get into keyboards. Um, I'm, okay. Also, just so you guys understand my bias with this, I hate cake. The majority of cake just is so unsatisfying to me. The majority of it. There are still some, yes, that I really like. I'm just not really a cake person. I, I prefer a lot of other desserts. Cake is last on my, my list. Okay, let me take that back. I don't hate cake. I just would choose anything else over cake. Like quite literally. Uh, I got into the hobby two years ago. It's crazy how accessible it is now. It's so true, dude. Muffins all the way, yes. All right, to those who are wondering my trick so of putting nice. this in these days, once it's slotted like this, it does push up over here. What I do is I just grab the keycap puller. You can even just grab one side. I actually took one apart just for this one reason. Um, and I push in. Be careful for the case, obviously. So just push in so it seats nicely, even over here and over here too. And you can just slot it in and as you go, just keep pushing down this O-ring so it doesn't pop up and interfere with your backspace. Okay, and there we go. There we have it. So now we can start putting our keycaps on. Minty fresh. Dude, it is so minty fresh, dude. Did a pretty good job with the portal and sequence. I think he did a fantastic job. Dude, these, dude. Did I tell you guys, hey, you guys wanna know a secret too? For anyone who already does know this. Um, these are actually stock switches, by the way. They're factory lubed and they are phenomenally factory lubed. Uh, yeah, this is like an ice cream palette. It's really cute. This whole, this whole build is actually really cute. Let's see what this sounds like. So we did put polyfill on this, by the way. After a four plate, uh, and that's it. It's a gummy O-ring. We use the stock O-ring, which I believe is 60A, I wanna say. There's the bounce from the O-ring. That's pretty nice, dude. And this is like minimal pressure. 
Ooh, hoo, hoo. Okay, let's see what this sounds like. This is uh, the stock O-ring, so 68 is 60 it? I have my portal build exactly like this. It's been amazing. It's so good. It's not highest end board or anything, but it sounds and feels pretty nice. That is exactly why I'm into this too. I have to admit though, it, it is seriously fantastic. I think also the polyfill is a must in this board. FYI, is stock 35A? What's, what color is this chat? What color is this? I thought stock was 60, is it not? Or 50 or something. This is the same one I put. Is this color 35? Seems quite flexy. It's really nice. It is flexy for sure. That's 40? Okay, so then I used 40A. That's the one I used. That should be 35? I don't know, dude. I wish they just color coded these better than light blue, dark blue, and medium blue. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's it's wild though, because like, I don't know if you guys can cap capture this on camera. Okay, see this space bar over here? See this like little line? the black gap between the keyboard. Okay, watch, watch my just like. That is, it's not flexy, it's bouncy. The whole thing moves. And it becomes a really soft typing experience. Fantastic board. What are my thoughts on long uh, stem switches like cow switches? Uh, the cow switches, I didn't love the spring in, but they're fine. I like long pole switches, they're great. What do you guys think though? I like this keyboard, it turned out good. I think this might be one of, I think this is my second favorite sequence to date. The switches sound fantastic. This is this is probably my second favorite sequence to date. I, I personally think that the sequence is better value than the portal unless you really want the portal aesthetic. Thank you, thank you, dude. Enjoy Geo's stream. Um, I will talk to you guys later. And I like I like the sequence, by the way, cool. I'll talk to you guys later though. Uh, I'm gonna go watch the movie. I'll tell you guys how I like Morbius. It's time to morb for me, chat. It's time to morb. All right, talk to you guys later, dude. Bye.